What's up, YouTube? Back out here again, this time with my good friend Celestina. Hi. Okay? <laughs> and so, me and uh, Celestina, aka Stina Rams on the ground, we are at the Luxor Hotel Casino and Suites, the Tower Suites. And I had Celestina or Stina come through because I wanted to make some content for the ground for YouTube and do like a hotel boudoir shoe slash glamour shoe slash we're just gonna do what we do and you know, put some sauce on it. Oh, just drop it. <laughs> Got the homie in the background. Uh, but anyways, uh, I will be shooting with my Nikon Z6 and I will be recording the screen with my Adibus Ninja so you guys can see what I'm seeing. And then I will be doing behind the scenes as well with my Nike, uh, Panasonic G85. So yeah, as always, enjoy the show. Um, if you have any questions, put them below. I'll link everything. And uh, yeah, I'll just try to explain what I'm doing as best as possible and uh, we'll make it do what it do. You ready? I'm ready. Oh, and then we got a, a homie in the background. Uh, hello. You gonna come? Uh, you gonna come? Yeah. Kia, Kia, Kia. Right, yeah. <laughs> This is she's here to make sure I don't kidnap uh, Stina you know. or do anything. We don't want no me too situation. <laughs> <laughs> so it's two against one, but I got y'all. I got my back. I got there my camera. Go. So like, things they go <laughs> down. <laughs> right here. So, <laughs> but all right, let's go. <laughs> cool. <clears throat> okay, YouTube. So lighting wise. Um, what's going on is I have my model here. My big source of light is this huge window right here. Let me actually bring my ISO down. So this big source of light right here is lighting my model right here. Bring my ISO back up. Bam. So this is my main source. The window light coming from over here is my main source of light. And yeah, and this is the set. So just so you guys know, lighting, in model <laughs> and, and this is my yeah this is my natural light this is my main source of light so yeah okay so before we get into things i want to take a second to give a shout out to skillshare that's right skillshare the online learning community for creatives with more than twenty five thousand classes uh based in design business photoshop if you want to learn to be a better photographer, make better YouTube videos, get your Instagram popping, you name it, they probably got it. Skillshare is super affordable with an annual subscription less than $10 a month. A premium membership gives you unlimited access so you can join classes and communities that are just right for you in your New Year's goals. My personal goal has been to get better at retouching and color grading, so I've been taking advantage of the communities and the classes that are centered around retouching and color grading in Photoshop to be specific. So, join more than 7 million creators learning with Skillshare. And if you're one of the first 500 of my subscribers to use the link in the description, you'll get a two-month free trial. So whether you want to fuel your curiosity, creativity, or even career, Skillshare is the perfect place for you to keep learning and thriving in 2019. So again, make sure you're one of my first 500 subscribers to hit the link in the description so you can get that two-month free trial. Alright, now let's back to the show. Sweet. So... First thing we're gonna do is, uh, I'm gonna have you actually lay in the bed. I like how you were laying in the bed. You, um, I'm gonna have you bring this arm back. Yeah, yeah perfect. Um, and then lean your body over this way. Yeah, yeah perfect. Yep, yeah, just like that. Actually, lean the whole body over and come to this edge. And then turn your whole body this way. Bring these feet up, just like that. Stop, boom. Hold that. Don't move. Don't move, stay there. Switch into the face. Awesome. Put it on as I click. Perfect. Chin up. Um, I liked how you were arched up, so let's get that out the way. Like you are trying to make sure you Yeah, just like that. Yeah, uh huh. Yeah, hold that. I want it to look like you actually like. Yeah, yeah, just like that. Yeah. Hold that. Yeah, yeah, just like that. Perfect. Okay. 
first. What up folks, hope you're enjoying the video so far. Just wanted to pop in here and give you guys some background, some context, and some commentary over what I'm doing, the mood of the shoot, what's going down. As you can see right here, I'm using a filter to try to get some um, vintage flare vibes going on. Um, I used natural light for the entire shoot, so like basically I was using the big windows that were behind me in uh, both situations to try to light the model and just position her based on that light but also be aware of my backgrounds and what's in the photo and then I took out the filters or the, the fractal filters to try to add maybe a little creative flair or a little creative twist to the photo so when you see like the little crazy reflections and stuff that's just me using my filters and prisms to try to add a little spice to uh, an already dope picture. Now again, as I stated earlier, the vibes I was going for in this shoot was like hotel, uh, central, boudoir, slash glamour vibes. And I wanted like an authentic, organic feel to the photos. And so that kind of was more of why I decided to just use natural light. I had a big lighting source behind me, which is the big windows. And so I just relied on that as being my only source of light. And then in some shots I used a reflector, but you know, in these situations, in order to get like a moody vibe, like a more, like add more depth to the photos, I kind of let the shadows fall where they fall and just adjust the model accordingly so that she's lit well enough to, you can see her face and that enough of her body is lit, but then bring in some shadows to give more of a, give more of a moody, uh, what is the word, moody, Again, organic vibe. And then I edited the photos likely too in Lightroom to kind of get that vibe as well. So hopefully this all makes sense and you help help you understand like why I'm shooting. I didn't break out any flashes. I actually did a shoot the day before and we broke out some lightings towards the end of that shoot, but that shoot was mostly, mostly natural light as well. And so. once again if you made it this far you are the real mvp so give yourself a pat on the back okay and then also leave a comment in the description letting me know that you made it this far and that you're still around and hit that thumbs up because you know i need all the support i can get and um yeah like i said if you have any questions leave them below uh let me know what you think of the shoot and uh yeah stay tuned for the next video all right peace out <laughs>